groups of video will be recorded in the Jisun hour. I'm going to explain you how you can use HTML in your Python code. So that before using that, we will import another method called render template. What it does, it uh, uses our HTML file and store it into the Python directory. So after importing it, what you have to do is to create a folder under this under the main folder in my case I have created the templates table templates and make sure that you use the same name for creating the template in this tutorial we are going to create the template for our HTML website so make sure you hit this template do this template keyword and here in this you will have to add a file in my case I have added a home.html and now you have to type in html and if you know python it will be a piece of cake to write code in html so guys to write it you have to simple first you have to add a doc type then everything will start with a doc type you know that you have to create html and here we have to add body and here we have to add a header let's say home page after that you have to add some description so let's say this is my home page so that's all what you have to do then simply in return type simply put this render template and here in this template simply put the file name which we have recently added in my case it is this file home.html you must save it and run the file again you will get the font like this same you can do with the about us page here you can see about page you can give the header you can give the description and uh, then you have to simply go to your main file and here in case of this text you have to add render template and here in this template you have to type the file name then Go here and run your file. And here, if I go to about the space, you will get this about the space like this. You can create multiple pages like this. So, write something yourself. And in the next tutorial, I will give you some more things like how you can navigate in the website. So stay tuned with me and thank you. Meet you in the next tutorial.